defeating bank and government corruption by law. Here are a few statute codes of law you may want to learn regarding bank and government corruption and how to defeat them in court when you use them in the proper context. <laughs> Title 18 USC 241 states federal laws are lawfully binding on all states. That means federal laws are superior to state laws to the contrary. <clears throat> the 11th amendment states that, that we are subject to criminal and civil actions of attorneys through their complaints and lawsuits. These are usually commenced and prosecuted in the name of some imaginary person, like a corporation, bank, or whatever, or trust. The corporate state, corporate bank, or corporate United States, or corporate corporation, or, you know, they're all corporations, folks. <clears throat> all cases of this nature are prohibited in all three foreign states, in all these foreign states by the 11th Amendment of that 1787 Territorial Federal Constitution for the United States of American Union. Of the several state nations, to commence or prosecute any action or litigation, to file any cause of action with one of these plaintiff, as plaintiff is fraud. That means Bank of America cannot sue you. The United States cannot sue you. State of Florida cannot sue you. It has to be an actual person that sues you. And these are under 18 U.S.C. 1001 and Conspiracy Against Rights, 18 U.S.C. 241. Now, the Sixth Amendment secures the accused, which is you, the defendant, the right to face all witnesses against you. Therefore, this law requires the plaintiff, the injured party, bank, or whatever it may be, be a physical, living, homo sapiens, man, woman, or child that can be cross-examined. This is why Bank of America cannot sue you or foreclose on your home. The state of Florida, state of New York, state of California, state of cannot sue you in the name of the state. But you have to object to these and ask them to prove their jurisdiction. The only time an attorney can act without a physical home, living homo sapiens man, woman, or child plaintiff is in the case of murder. All other cases require the plaintiff to be present in court, but you must demand that the victim show up, testify, and be cross-examined. The Sixth Amendment also states the accused has a right to face the accused, defendant's accuser, in any civil or criminal court. <clears throat> the accuser must be a man, woman, or child. Upon demand to produce victim, the prosecutor shall produce the injured party. If prosecutor cannot produce an injured party, man, woman, or child, ask for a dismissal with prejudice of the bank lawsuit complaint for lack of injured party must and shall and it shall be granted the accused or defendants by the court. The court has no jurisdiction to proceed if they cannot provide an injured party. And if they do proceed against jurisdiction you can write your your uh, uh, your state senator and have them taken away, have have their office taken away, have them uh, have them be uh, how should I put it, fired, okay, as a judge. <clears throat> Principle of the law states to establish a crime has been committed. 
there must be present physical evidence that you injured another human being or damaged his or her property. Attorneys have created imposter laws that establish victimless crimes, which is fraud and illegal. This is fraud under 18 U.S.C. 1001 for, an, for any attorney to present these imposter crimes without injured party, claiming authority to prosecute. When a plaintiff cannot be cross-examined, no judge can prove due process of law, justice, or jurisprudence was administered. Conspiracy against rights, 18 U.S.C. 241 of the prosecutor and judge acting in procedural misconduct. Procedural misconduct in conspiracy to convict must be reported to the proper authority. Failure of that authority to prosecute the attorney and judge is misprison of felony under 18 U.S.C. 4. Demanding rights. When you are arrested on a warrant for traffic violation, be demand to be taken before the judge who issued the warrant right then immediately, which is your right. Taking you to jail is kidnapping. Being held for ransom, involuntary servitude, and human trafficking when they charge a fee. Every warrant issued is to bring you before the court, the judge, not take you to jail. You are guilty of nothing and cannot be subjected to possible violence of jail without due process of law. Otherwise, you can sue for damages any third party official including the judge. Demand to be taken before the judge immediately. If the, ju if the officer refuses, tell officer, I now charge you with kidnapping, involuntary servitude, and human trafficking, and you will be talking to with a U.S. attorney when, you, when I am released. A bond. A bond is for one purpose to ensure your appearance in court. Tell the judge your word is your bond, you will appear. I will not allow you to extort money on my word, tell them. Any amount you demand of me to retain my freedom is extortion. This man states for the record, my word is my bond and I will appear. Think about it. Each processed new credit agreement, debt payoff financial security instrument between you and your bank at debtloanpayoff.com and cancel1mortgage.info are legally registered state licensed processed new credit agreement payoff negotiable financial security instruments similar to federally registered FRN dollars, mortgage promissory notes, mortgage debt lien securities, contracts, and auto financing credit applications. Cap security instruments are also used as money under the federal UCC statutes and codes, but for bank debt payoff similar to bank created money debt and loans that creates debts. Banks actually verify and accept the cap security to pay off mortgages and other bank or financial debts. Registration pursuant to the federal SEC rules and the United States statutes qualifies the legally processed cap financial security instrument as a bank ver verified money and legal tender of payment for all debts with no interest payments. No capital gains taxes are notarized are registered securities pursuant to the Federal Security Exchange Commission SEC rules, statutes, codes, and law. Pays bank claimed debt meets all negotiable financial security instrument laws and is considered promissory note money, just like the Federal Reserve note 
promissory, international promissory note dollars. I am not a private corporate foreign bar attorney and do not practice law, nor give legal advice, but I have attended many court cases, conducted countless interviews with banksters, attorneys, judges, law enforcement officials, and court officials in my 20 years of research to uncover banking fraud facts for you. These banking fraud facts are in my written client instructions that guarantee you win your court case where I give you 100% of the processing cost back when you become a client and want or need to pay your presumed debt or financial debts if and when you follow my written client instructions, folks. We instruct you how to fight bank and foreclosure fraud to win in courts. Details are in the CAP Financial Security Instrument client instructions after you become a client that have been proven to win any court case at your court hearing or trial by jury. This is why we offer you the 100% money back guarantee for our processing cost if you don't win, when and if you follow the steps and do what is in our client instructions. Please visit cancelonemortgage.info forward slash down payment, one word, to learn how to change a few words on your mortgage documents at the notary closing table to own your home or commercial property with just the down payment with no reoccurring payments after the closing. Avoid and never pay new property taxes on your newly purchased home or commercial business at the same time with the filing of a correct bill of sale and a deed of ownership, a warranty deed when closing at cancelonemortgage.info forward slash cash down, one word, and buy these two silver bullet pamphlets together today to own a new home of your own without property taxes or payments with just the down payment. There are other e-booklets on my cancelonemortgage.info site that you might consider using as all of these e-booklets have been successful by, you, by giving you a great life free of debt. Please subscribe to my David Young video channel and comment on all this man's videos if you have questions. Let us know what you think so you may be able to help other people and earn $2,000 at the same time. Okay? Have a great life, debt free with our uh, CAP Security Service, and may God bless you all, folks. Think about it.